The idea for this video came from this comment here on my recent Sony A7S III exposure video. And the question is, what's the difference between lower limit and standard plus range modes? Let's go and take a look at this. First thing you need to do is head into the menus for your camera and then head down to zebra settings. In the A7S III here, you need to come down to the exposure color menu, head across and then come down to zebra display. Make sure zebra display is turned on here and then head into zebra level. You can see here that you can choose from a number of predefined zebras from 70 all the way up here to 100 plus. And you've also got this custom one and custom two zebra setup. Let's head into custom one and notice here you can set two different modes. You can either set lower limit or standard plus range mode. Let's start off with the lower limit mode. When you're using lower limit, you can set a zebra value all the way up to 109 plus and all the way down to 50 plus. So what does this lower limit mode do? Basically, the lower limit mode will show zebras for anything in the scene that's above the limit that you set. So we've set a lower limit here of 50 plus. If we just OK that and come back to our view, you can see we've got zebras on most of the lighter areas. If we go and increase the exposure of this image, for example, with ISO, notice that as we increase the exposure, zebras appear on more and more areas of the image. And that's because it's going to show us zebras for anything more than 50. And as we continue to increase the exposure, we get more and more zebras. And if we keep going, we'll eventually get zebras covering the whole screen. Let's just reset this back to ISO 640. Let's head back into the menu and once again into zebra level. And this time, rather than lower limit mode, we're going to choose standard plus range mode. Once again, we're going to set the zebra level at 50. But notice here we can actually go lower here all the way down to zero, but we'll set it at 50. And we also get this additional option, this plus or minus value. Let's start off with plus or minus one. Basically what this will do now is it will show zebras at 50 plus or minus one. So basically from 49 to 51. Let's hit okay. We can see we've got a few zebras here. Let's once again go and increase the exposure by increasing the ISO. But notice now as we increase the ISO, we're not getting zebras cover the whole screen. We're just getting zebras in that band of exposure. 49 to 51 and once again we can keep going up and we're only going to get zebras for that band of exposure and if we go all the way up here notice we don't have zebras covering the screen let's just head back to ISO 640 and we'll head back into the zebra setup rather than choose plus one let's instead choose a wider range and we can go all the way up to plus or minus 10. what we're going to get now are zebras for anything at 50 plus or minus 10. so basically anything in the exposure range 40 to 60 we're going to get zebras show up Let's hit OK. Notice now we're getting a lot more zebras on the screen because we've increased the range of exposure where zebras will appear. Once again, let's increase the exposure by using ISO. And as we head up here, we see zebras covering more of the scene. Anything from 40 to 60 will show zebras. 